You know, I'm sitting here trying to figure this crap out. You know, I, I'm coming down to the beach. I, I arrived here yesterday. And on the way down, somebody in my family talked about dying. I don't like to hear about death now. Now, let me tell you about this. Somebody, I don't name names. I'm innocent bystander on this. But somebody in my family, when they die, wants to be buried, cremated and buried under a tree trunk. I just don't understand this junk. Let me tell you. So I have them give me some, some uh, information on this kind of junk here. And it said, be a tree. Organic burial pods will turn your loved ones into trees. Replace cemeteries with forest tree with forest trees. What kind of bull crap's that? No, oh, I'm gonna return to Earth as a tree. I don't believe that one bit. So I'm sitting there. You know, being a smart butt, you know, like guys are. I said, so you don't come back to life as a tree. She says, oh yeah, the leaves and the branches don't be my hair. I said, so what happens when you get cut down or struck by lightning? You don't say, ow, ow, ooh, and die again? No, no, no. And I said... So you're going to be placed in a tree trunk. No, no, no. I'm going to be buried in the ashes. And I will come back up as the tree grows and transform into a tree. He said, this going to be modern day stuff. And I said, uh-uh. I said, I don't believe it. So I'm here doing my research on it. And evidently this crap's true. So, let me tell you something. So, you're alive like you are now, but you don't be in spirit transferring into a tree. She said, yeah. I said, well, that's going to be a whole lot of siblings. Come Christmas time, you're going to have to spend a lot of money on Christmas gifts. You know how many trees there are in the world if you're alive? You have to buy Christmas gifts. You know? Your siblings will want to have Christmas gifts. Whether it's water to water your trunk. Or dirt to put around your roots. Or horse poop to, you know, fertilize the roots. Or to hire a picker to pick off the, uh, the apples off your shirt tree for you. And plus, that's not counting the insurance, the gas... For the limousine, you know, you have to transfer these little ones around. You know, these little green uh, pot plants, you know. Got, got to pay for the gas and insurance. This is dumb. So I'm sitting here trying to toss some sense into this, pe this person. And she still won't. I said, all right. I come visit you every day. I'll bring my dog by. And he'll fertilize your tree for you. If you get what I mean. She said, I just want to tell you where I'm buried. I said, well, I'll hire me a private investigator then. She said, put your head. I said, well, I will. Turn cemeteries into forest uh, uh, fields. That's about the dumbest bullcrap out of it. You know, I bet Obama started this junk. Uh, I bet you anything. I bet him and his uh, foreigners got together and tried to figure out how to um, come up with different ways to bury people. And return them back to life. It's just it's probably outdoing his double woman crap. I bet you anything it is. He's about the dumbest man ever. 
No, I'm surprised Obama didn't pick his, him and his uh, vice president, that, that little retarded guy. Yeah. I about said bad word there. I'm not kidding. All right, now. That's all I got today, but hey. Ain't been buried in no uh, tree cemetery. Peace out.